हेलो फ्रेंड्स माय नेम इज शालू पाल वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल लर्न बाय वॉच टुडे वी विल लर्न अबाउट पीपल स्किल्स गुड पीपल स्किल्स आर एन एसेट फॉर एवरी ऑर्गेनाइजेशन इट इज द एबिलिटी टू लिसन टू कम्युनिकेट एंड टू रिलेट टू अदर्स ऑन अ प्रोफेशनल और पर्सनल लेवल इन ऑलमोस्ट ऑल जॉब्स योर पीपल स्किल्स हैव एन इम्पैक्ट ऑन योर सक्सेस लाइक योर टेक्निकल स्किल्स whether you work as a team lead or you work within the team of professionals you need to apply people skills to achieve your objectives so today we will learn definition of people skills what are people skills people skills required for workplace importance of people skills in the workplace how to improve people skills so let us see first we will uh, learn definition of people skills according to british dictionary the definition of people skills is the ability to communicate effectively with people in a friendly way especially in business or personal effectiveness skills uh, so now you can easily get the definition of people skills ki ultimately what we are learning we are learning to ability to communicate effectively so this is about the definition of people skills in business it is connection among people in a human level to achieve productivity so this is very important to learn people skills especially when you are doing business because in business you have to connect with different people to get a uh, success in your business and to achieve productivity so this is very important let's see the list of people skills required for workplace first is the ability to relate to others almost every work environment you experience in your professional life will require you to interact with other people knowing how to effectively socialize within your social environment has become very important skill within the workplace you will have to relate to managers coworkers and customers effectively to be successful in your position second is keep patience with others if you are patient with others and can keep a level head in stressful situation it will definitely be noticed by management and perceived as a very strong asset as per emi uh, who is the president of talent zoo when your boss is forced to deal with a situation where people have lost their cool he or she will certainly remember the trouble makers when the next promotion comes available third is the ability to trust others you can only accelerate your career if you are trustworthy without it you can't get projects done or get cooperation fourth is to be supportive and motivate others people want others to believe in them regardless of how successful they might be by showing support in the form of encouragement you can motivate someone to be back on track in right direction fifth is knowing when and how to show empathy it allows us to create relationships with others offer support sympathy and feedback in your daily professional life life is unpredictable by knowing when and how to show empathy when others face problem is extremely important sixth is self awareness self awareness is having a clear perception of your personality including strengths weakness thoughts beliefs motivation and emotions self awareness allows you to understand other people how they perceive you your attitude and your responses to them in the moment seventh is showing interest in others while having conversation with anyone always show genuine interest to others by listening what they say and responding to them remember names dates and important events eighth is flexibility you should be able to shift adjust and react as per work work environment today's changing world requires high flexibility in the job ninth is good judgment good judgment is a skill that comes directly from learning 
listening to others and observing the world around you it helps you in making right decisions 10th is the ability to persuade others there is a good chance that at some point in your career you will have to sell others on your ideas products or services so whenever you are up for a promotion pitching a project or selling clothing in a retail store you need to be able to form a strong convincing argument for why you or your products are the very best or the right one 11th people skill is to be open minded always keep your mind open to look more approachable and easier to work with this will create trust and respect in others especially uh, other employees will understand their feedback and opinion will be considered and valued 12th is a great sense of humor everyone enjoys laughing it is the great stress reliever if you will be working more seriously then you will lost uh, then you will get lost in that job have some fun in a job this will also increase your productivity 13th is honesty the saying honesty is the best policy is not only true it's essential in building trust among your colleagues once you lose it it's almost impossible to regain people want to work with those they can trust 14th is good body language we all know the importance of body language through our gestures facial expressions voice postures and appearance play a very important role in communication 15th is good manners using please and thank you will help you a lot in professional life always speak with due respect with your colleagues avoid gossiping and disrespecting your seniors because it can destroy your image in long term career 16th is active problem solving work is a series of problem solving situations but if you are active you will take the pressure off your boss and colleagues this is a great people skill to achieve success in the job uh so next we will see the importance of people skills in the job so as we know the people skills are the ability to communicate with each other in a friendly way especially at job office let's be honest when people stay together for about 8 to 9 hours in a day compete with each other for a position or a promotion learn together and fail together things can get a bit uncomfortable amongst them which makes it even more difficult for them to have an understanding of people skill so my first point is build trust and respect people skills build a relationship of trust and respect between employees which is important for smooth functioning of an organization second point is to add value to the organization as they enable a person to effectively communicate with others and decrease the possibility of miscommunication third point is it helps in resolving conflicts at job it becomes essentially importance for an employee to have an opinion these days if they are willing to succeed at work thus mutual understanding and effective communication is must fourth point is it leads to good coordination no matter what role you play in your organization your ability to work effectively with others leads to good coordination between employees fifth point is it discourages impulsiveness people skills not only help others to express in a better way but also encourages listening carefully and then reacting to a problem or a situation so it discourages impulsiveness this quality is very essential at senior management level because it focuses on the theory of understanding others and providing a feedback post observing the behavior of an individual sixth point is motivated employees employees with good people skills feel motivated towards work because the line of communication between the management and them is clear and open Seventh point is building positive attitude thinking positively is also one of the major aspects when it comes to people skills a person with positive attitude will always have a positive approach to a problem rather than being aggressive or defensive about it eighth point is effective decision making it pushes an individual to be more analytic and collaborate with others to solve problems using a variety of problem solving tools and techniques 
This ultimately helps in effective decision making to achieve objective successfully. Ninth point is it helps in socializing. Talking to people and maintaining good relations helps in building harmony, trust and mutual respect in the organization. An employee will be more transparent and open to the management when the employee expresses himself. Tenth point is management control. An individual with good people skills will always prove to be the most effective leader as well since that person will be on the path of taking all the employees together as a team and would work on the overall development, welfare and growth of an organization, it helps management to control the functioning of organization. So now let us see how to improve people skills. This question may be in your mind that how we can improve our people skills because you want to help uh, maintaining your relationships it, and also you want to accelerate your career. So my first point for this is to connect with people. Meeting new people can enhance your creativity, improve your emotional intelligence. When meeting someone new, pay attention to non-verbal communication uh, such as good postures, appropriate eye contact and friendly gestures. Rely on communication and listening skills. Truly get to know people by allowing them to express themselves without immediately interrupting with your own ideas. Second point is learn to listen to others. Talking is simple. Real communication requires good listening skills. When others are speaking, instead of actually listening to them, many people on concentrating, uh, many people are concentrating on what they plan to say next. Doing this can cause you to miss key elements of the other person's point and results in a lack of communication. Let the other person speak without interrupting. Focus on what other another person is saying and making eye contact helps you to truly understand what is meaningful and will help you in speaking your own point of view while giving him response. Third is respect cultural differences. We learn most of our people skills from our parents and others in our community. When communicating with someone from a different culture, it is important to respect cultural differences. In our culture, direct eye contact often indicates sincerity, while in another culture it could be considered rude. Fourth point is to develop your emotional intelligence. Emotional intelligence means to be aware of our emotions. Sharpening your emotional intelligence will help you to keep your emotions balanced and boost your confidence. Learn to become aware of your emotions and responses to certain situations. Keep your emotion in balance. Fifth point is to be, to be pleasant and approachable. Show that you are an approachable and pleasant person to interact with. By smiling, a genuine smile shows openness, is attractive to others. Being able to smile will help others be more willing to smile as well and make the entire office more pleasant. Sixth point is practice being empathetic. That mean, this means trying to see the issue from the side of the person you are relating to. Communicating that you understand with someone you are interacting with will go on a long way toward developing positive, trusting relationships. Seventh point is to maintain relationships. Healthy relationships boost your confidence and make your life more rewarding. Take the time to be aware of the important people and relationships in, in, in your life. In order to respect others, you must respect yourself. Have the right positive attitude and go ahead. My eighth point for you is to take your time and communicate clearly. Maintain relaxed posture so that people can, com so that people can communicate with you more comfortably. Don't be in a rush. Take your time to communicate more clearly and effectively to avoid misunderstandings. Ninth point is to ask for feedback. When you take a moment to ask for feedback, you communicate better and you are more likely to hear and share ideas. People don't want to feel like they are hearing a lecture. By asking for feedback and other people's opinion on a matter, you show that you are willing to hear and explore others' point of view. Asking for feedback shows that you have a confident and positive attitude. Tenth point is respect opinions of others. Always welcome others' opinions and try to understand them. 
respect their opinions and acknowledge them thank you for watching this video hope you have understood about people skills thanks again keep watching my videos and subscribe my channel learn by watch press the bell icon to get the notifications thank you once again